Oh my god, this is... I'm scared. <laughs> How do I... <laughs> Hi everyone, it's Lottie. Um, not to like do another haul video, but I have a lot of things that I need to kind of share. We've got a lot of videos coming up this month. Basically, I need to do this haul so that I can set up my binders to sort cards away and then I can sort cards away and then I can do my end of year collection tour. And like I have some other things and like there's comebacks coming up and stuff and there's just a lot. Also, um, first video on new phone. I got this phone an hour ago. <laughs> I've literally just finished like setting everything up and logging into everything. Now I am filming and I hope that it's in frame and fine. I'm begging. <laughs> it looks great so far. We're getting upgrades. So um, as you can see today I have a haul. It was gonna be like a haul clip but then I've literally been stockpiling this for so long that it is literally its own video now. We've got a Neo Kyo box, we've got some purchases, we've got a lot of ghost stuff, we've got more ghost stuff, mm, buy ye Neo Kyo things. There's a lot. So um, yeah, I don't know where to go through first. I think I'm gonna start with the Gravity albums and then we can move into I guess the other albums because they're big and then we can just put cards on top great idea yeah I'll do that okay we're starting with Gravity albums probably because I've had these the longest and I just haven't showed you them yet I have already put the stuff away from these so I don't have the physical cards to show you I guess um but uh, Gravity had to come back pretty recently. I say recently, wasn't it like September? <laughs> so I got a copy of the photo book. I did just get one because I wasn't employed at the time, but now I have a job and like money. So I can actually like buy compacts now. Wow, look at me go. But I have the Us version. It can have the little cheeky look. Look how cute this photo book is. Um, there we go. Some serum stickers. I think I got serum for the postcard too. I did. It's a fun shape though. There he is. Best boy himself. So this is the Oz version of the photo book. And then I did also get the Kino as I usually collect Kinos for Gravity. They're like the only group I buy Kinos for. And this is my friend's Instagram who I joined the girl from. They do amazing goes for and hyphen, sometimes they do the seraphim, uh, gravity, of course. There it is, there's the Kino. I do collect three members of gravity with serum being my bias, so I collect serum for like Kino and everything else. They also did member jewel cases this time, which is very either of them, but I mean, they're under the same company, and like Monster X had done them before. We were expecting them for a while, they didn't do it until this comeback though, so I do have Serum's jewel case as well. So that's it for the Gravity stuff. I don't have the photo cards with me because I did already put them away. So I guess if you watched my last sorting video, you know what cards I got. <laughs> so that's it for the Gravity stuff. Then I did go to a K-pop shop before work earlier this week, but literally like a day or two before AT's announced their comeback, <laughs> I went to the K-pop shop and I got a copy of A Seraphim's Fearless as I wanted a, like the big photo book copy version of it because it's one of the best albums of the year for me. And they also had the Cheshire limited version and I don't normally buy limited versions of Itzy albums but this one is like really nice. And I really like the cover of it, so I was like, hmm, might as well, because the cards are really cute too. Look, I pulled the OT5 version of this. How cute is that? I didn't know these were random either until I saw people trading. I'll quickly go through my pulls with you. So for Itzy, there's a lot of things for Itzy, so I'll do that first. 
For Itzy, I got a Yeji folded poster. Then for the clear postcard, I got Rujin. I have really solid Rujin look, apparently. Because for my photo cards, I got Yeji for the lenticular. I got this really, really nice Rujin card. I really like it. And then I also got this Yuna. So I am training these Cheryong currently, though it's so close to Christmas now that I'm not posting anything. Anything that I post will be after New Year. Just keep that in mind if you're like trading and stuff right now. Then for Fearless, I got the black petrol version. I did almost get the blue cipher one because I really like the mermaid concept, but my friend convinced me to get the black petrol one as she has Kazuo's car and she wants Chewan. And so if I pull Chewan, we could just trade. Um, unfortunately, I did not pull Chewan, but um, my bias look struck again and I pulled Yunjin. So true. So yeah, I have this really, really beautiful Yunjin card, which I do already own as I do have both of her normal Fearless photo cards. But yeah, she's currently up for trade for Chewan. As I'm trying to trade up, you know, so I can trade with my friend. I got some posts from my friend Mari, who is like my 80s gong, and there's a lot. So first of all, there's some stuff from the Wonderwall releases from earlier this year. So I have both of the like photos that you know had for the releases. So these are so nice. I'm definitely excited to put these in my big inclusions binder. Before we go into the photo cards for albums, I have you know's a digi pack from World Episode One Movement. I mean, it slaps. Look at him. Look at him go. I do actually have two copies of his digi pack now, and I am getting Uyongs from Mari and like my next Mari mail. I think I'm gonna either sell or trade my spare you know digi pack because I just don't need to. And finally, I have an actual copy of the World Episode 1, but it's a Uno you know, signed copy. We managed to get some of the US exclusive Hello 82 albums. I know they've done signed albums for the new comeback. I did not manage to get them from either the US link or the Europe link, which is really annoying. Um, they put them up for sale at like 4 a.m. my time, so I completely missed it by like four or five hours. But I'm happy that I have this one at least. So I have a Yuno signed album now. Oh my god. And I have a whole stack of photo cards to show you. So first of all, this is the very last card from Fever Part 3 that I've been waiting for all year. The one that Mari kept forgetting and he's just lived on her bookshelf for months. Uh, this is Apple Music 3 Yuno. So put him right here in a place of honor because he's beautiful i'm so happy to finally have him i can put fever part three behind me so happy then this is from season songs this is the second round of hello 82 photo cards i needed that one as well then we have an album card from world at one this is literally just gonna be me throwing you knows everywhere now so have the first Hello 82 card from Season Songs, which I do already have, so I'm gonna have to do something about him. Then this is Tower Records, you know, from Last Era. One of Uyong's, I think it's his US exclusive card. There's a couple of like green screen ones. I'm pretty sure this is his US exclusive. Then we have you know's Hello 82 card. This is the crossword one. This, you know, is his Digipack photo card. Then we have this, you know, which I think is his Hello82 indie photo card, I'm pretty sure, which was sold at like specific US based K pop stores. This is also Tower Records. I think this is Japan Fan Club, but I might be wrong. There's literally so many of these. And we have this, you know, I don't know which one he is. He might be Tokopedia. I think he might be Tokopedia actually. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> Big brained. He's Tokopedia. Anyway, green screen, you know, pouts. We have his US exclusive card. Question mark. I think. <laughs> 
and we have Wuyang's uh, Hello Lady 2 crossword card as well. I'm pretty sure with this I'm done with Yuno's like, Yuno and Wuyang for all the Hello Lady 2 like US exclusive stuff from last year that I wanted. So that's amazing. Then these three photo cards are from their Wonderwall collaboration from earlier this year. Not like the latest ones, but the earlier ones. All the backs look like this. They're so cute. I love these cards. I love these cards. I'm going to store them like this, I think, which I don't think is in order, but just for like the colors. You get me? You get me? Like you understand, you know, it's going to look cute. And finally, we have a Yosang ID from diary version that was it for my 80s mail i think <laughs> i think and um, next we're gonna go into sales and goes and trades and stuff that i've done recently because there's like a little stack of them and another album great my desk is so full first of all i have this liz card from after like it's one of her like lucky draw message cards but it was really really cheap so i have her now <laughs> because she's really cute so i have this liz i miss her so bad then back when thursday's child came out i joined a group order for two sets of inclusions which i don't need anymore because i finished thursday's child <laughs> so um i have this yeonjin and kai uh postcard set and then for the lenticulars, I have Yeonjin and Taehyun. I think I tried to sort for Yeonjin, like I tried to get sorting for him, even though I don't collect him, just because I was already done with Taehyun and then my friend collects Bongyu and Yeonjin, so I like tried to get some cards for them. And I did actually get a card for them, um, they needed this Yeonjin. So I will be giving this to my friend Meg, and I also got this Taehyun. We have an 80s item, it's from my friend Lauren. Basically, one of the fan signs from this last era was like, if you bought three albums, you would get a random unit. And so I knew the units were going to be expensive. They've done units before, they did them back in Fever Part 2 era, and they were expensive. So uh, my friend Lauren did a claim for all of the units so i of course grabbed you knows so this is lottie thank you so much for joining i hope yun sang arrive safely miss you love lauren lauren and i will be reuniting at the london concert next year for 80s for break the wall tour finally they're coming to the uk again oh i miss them so badly if you're going to the london date for break the wall tour if you're in sector vip i will be there <laughs> But anyway, I have this Yuno know, and Yosang unit from Wonderwall from this last era. Got some stuff from my friend Jack. So first of all, this is the last version of the 11 Japanese version that I was missing. This is the fan club version, which was like, literally, I bought this twice because the first time I bought it, the seller sent me a regular version. So now I have like six pair of those instead of the fan club one and i was so annoyed so this is the second time i've paid for it and luckily i actually have one now so this is the fan club version it comes with a mirror so that's what this is on the back here but yeah it's super super gorgeous it didn't have a photo card in it but i do already have liz's fan club card which you will see pretty shortly but continuing on with the eye theme uh this is jack's note by the way hey bestie i hope he's arrived safely Front sweet. Love you, Jack. <laughs> I also got two Gala cards through him as he did briefly, like very, very briefly, collect Gal and decided to drop her. These are uh, Gal's jewel case and version two photo book cards. So I should be done completely with Gal now. Not including the Japanese debut cards because they're still on the way. But I should be done with her Korean album stuff. Yeah, more Ive stuff. Um, I have some pre-order benefits. That's what I was trying to say. I have some little fan sign cards for Liz. 
but for Liz here I have With Me, which is this one, and I think this is Music Korea. She's literally the cutest person ever. This one. This is from another girl manager. I think these were from Dazzling Trades, and then these are from Froggy Lover down here, who is a UK-based girl manager, and they're really, really super, super nice. And I am really sad I don't remember what shops these are from. Do I? No, I think they're Apple Music and Market Shop. They don't say on the back, but I'm pretty sure this is Apple Music. And then this one is Market Shop. So yeah, now we have lots more Liz to add to my eye binder, which I mean is always the best thing. That's my favorite girl ever. Some twice, this user said, thank you, I hope mama makes it safely. Please let me know when she arrives. And I did trade for a Summer Nights Momo. So I actually have OT9 set progress, which is like unheard of. I feel like I never make twice progress anymore. My channel used to have so much twice and now I'm like 90% Ive. <laughs> I have this beautiful Momo card from Summer Nights. I'm back. My camera stopped recording, so I have to go through a couple of the last things. But otherwise, I think the video looks fine. So I'll just go through these last trades and then I have a couple of things from Nyokyo to show you. So next we have the very last things I needed for my between one and two collection. I have Sana's crossword postcard here as well as Jonghyun's message card. That's what it's called. So between one and two should be completely done for both nine pocket and large room inclusions. I am really sorry if you wanted to see me open a trade up on camera. I did and it just it stopped recording after this last Momo card so really sorry about that then next we have this Serum card I traded some crafty stuff for this so this is one of his photo book cards I think I just need one more photo book card his jewel case and then just like units I think so yeah slow progress on gravity but I'm waiting until my groups like calm down and then I can kind of catch up on like a few little things. Krabby cards are really easy to find and pretty cheap, so it's not like too bad. Now we have my Naokyo items. So first of all, I need to mention this little thing that I'll just slot in right here. These are some Amifa four pocket pages. They're not mine, they're my friend Gems. And also belonging to Gem is this Uno card, which is the Japanese pre-order card that you could only get if you pre-ordered in person at their fellowship tour concerts back in July That's so specific. I'm very impressed. That I remember that actually I do have it myself already So you will have seen it in a previous video, but now we have some eye things to close out the video So first of all, we have the very last jewel case card that I need for after like so I have rays here Now I should be done with this whole spread in my next sorting video which i'm so excited for and we also have some amazing progress on the japanese debut i still need two photo cards to finish off after like but i also only need two cards to finish off 11 japanese version so i'm really close to finishing my ot6 album collection i'm really really happy about it so first of all we have some liz items we have Liz's fan club photo cards. This is from the fan club version, the diver version. I'll put her over here because she deserves it. It's really actually such a cute card. I'm sad it is a concept and not a selfie, but oh well, this is the only thing I'm collecting just Liz for, as well as like some extra other things for Japan debut. The Ivy and E versions I'm doing OT6 for, so it does like a whole spread. And speaking of extra Liz things, I also have this bookmark, which I feel like is from like HMV Japan or like Tower Records sort of thing. I don't know where it's from, but I have this little bookmark from the V concept. We continue the theme of the V concept. I do have three members for that version so I have Liz, I have Hyunso and I have Yujin and here's what all the backs look like. Literally so beautiful. This album has their best photo cards. I said it. It's so true. 
these sets are so cohesive and they're so beautiful and I can't wait to get everything on hand it's gonna be so 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 gorgeous I literally can't wait I am just missing one Ray card and one one young to be done with Japanese debut and I'm hoping I can get it done pretty soon I just need to find some like deals or like Japan sellers need to drop their prices because I'm not overpaying for these last cards I swear I really don't want to overpay and then last of all last thing for the whole video I have the i version cards for the same members so I have Liz, Hyunso and Yujin literally look how beautiful these sets are cohesive so cohesive it's so good I love it so much three members officially complete for Japanese debut I have Gal complete as well her stuff is just on the way to me from friends and I'm just missing one card for Ray, one card for One Young. so that is it for today I know it's another haul video I'm really sorry about that but I hope the quality is okay as I am filming on a new phone <laughs> We've got a lot of things to do in the coming weeks. We've got end of year collection tours. We've got sorting photo cards, setting up my binders for new comebacks, or comebacks that have already happened or comebacks that are coming. There's just a lot of stuff going on and I'm really excited to uh, experience it all with you. So uh, yeah, please let me know if you enjoyed today's video. I hope it's okay that it is another haul. I swear there's different content coming in the next coming weeks. I got a super secret like Christmas video coming. It's all good. Um, I'm trying to be more active on TikTok and Instagram and stuff. I'm trying my best. So yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.